Are there any petitions? The petition of Helen MacDonald on behalf of the Board of Trustees of Salisbury School requesting that the House support the retention of Salisbury School and note that more than 3,000 people have signed an online petition supporting this. The petition of Roy Reid on behalf of Grey Power Federation New Zealand requesting that the House urge the Government to protect the interests of current and former residents of Christchurch retirement villages in the Red Zone by increasing their settlement offers. Are there any papers? I hereby present the Controller and Auditor General's Annual Plan 2012-13, and that paper is published under the authority of the House. And I also present the report of the New Zealand delegates on the second New Zealand political exchange to the United States of America, 15 to 27 April 2012. Are there any select committee reports? Report of the Finance and Expenditure Committee on the addition to the supplementary estimates of appropriations for the year ended 30 June 2012. Reports of the Local Government and Environment Committee on the 2012-13 estimates for vote parliamentary commissioner for the environment, on the petition of Materia Ture, and on the report from the Controller and Auditor General, Local Government, results of the 2010-11 audits. Report of the Transport and Industrial Relations Committee on the 2012-13 estimates for vote ACC and vote employment. The report on the Controller and Auditor General's report on the results of the 2010-11 local government audits is set down for consideration. Are there any bills for introduction? There are no bills for introduction. The House then comes to questions for oral answer. And the first question stands in the name of John Hayes.